Alright, thanks Ollie. Thank you. Tell us, I said hi. I will. Alright. Hi, how are you? Hi, how you doing? Good. Give me a bowl out there chili. Sure. God, I love chili. Good. It's the greatest food ever created. Great, have a seat, I'll get you a bowl. I want you to know we spent a lot of time getting it right. Where'd you get this pepper? I got a special from Diablo Phil. You, you know, the guy with the El Camino. How? Why did I tell you about buying them in the back of a truck? Uh, it's okay. It's okay. I've known them a long time. It's not like we're buying chicken. Mm -hmm. What the hell? Oh my God. Hey, mister, are you alright? Are you alright? Hey, what is this? Is he drunk? Come on, buddy, get up from the table. Let me check his pulse. He's not breathing. What? He's dead. Is he dead? Dead? He's not breathing. I think he's dead. Is... <laughs> you better double check. Go lock the door. We have to call an ambulance. Are you... Go lock the damn door! Are you crazy? Dead guy on our table. We have a dead guy who ate our children. What do you think that says about the food? The guy is dead, okay? What did you put in the chili? What did I? Oh, I hate when you do that. Remember that trip to Rehoboth? Yeah, I remember the, the engine blew up. It was steaming and stalling. Oh, Mark? I guess that was my fault too. You seem to think that... You could have put oil in it. I could have put oil in it. I could have... Let me tell you something, miss. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on? What happened? He ate the chili. What's in this stuff? Irene Livingston, your mother and I put every last penny we had into this place, and I don't want to lose it because of one bad recipe. What are we going to do? Look, we take him out the back, we drop him in the alley, we find him, and then we call an ambulance. I just, I don't know. I don't, I, I don't, I, well, I just don't see this How are we going to move this guy? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how we're going to move him. That worked. Damn, stuck again. Get me a hammer and we'll force it open. That's a wrench, girl. I need you to be calm. Oh shit. Here comes Vinnie Antonini. Oh shit. Oh, double shit. So you guys got the new chili recipe? Well... Yeah. Two years ago, out in Santa Fe, Arizona. Out of the biggest regional chili cook-off out there. Isn't Santa Fe in Mexico? Whatever. Guess what? I won! <laughs> so there I was. Santa Fe. Me. Some pinto beans. Rice. A little cheese. Special sauce. A whole lot of talent. <laughs> Guess what? I won an award. Let me show you my plaque. <laughs> there it is. That's my name. I won! <laughs> Wife didn't think I could win. I didn't have any doubt. Hottest sauce, hottest chili, this side of the Rio Grande. Well, in Santa Fe, they love me. The women love me. And all the other cooks were jealous of me. <laughs> So, why did you come back? Turns out, I want to be the chili king of the East Coast. Only one problem. Bankers don't see it my way. I can't get the financing. Me! So, here I am in this dump. I gotta try some of your chili. See what you people know. How about a bowl of it? Let us get you a bowl. Okay. What time you get done tonight? Hmm. We'll see. 
actually for you. What happened? I guess she just passed out. <clears throat> That's a new one for me. I usually just get the runs. Kick my ass again, and I do care. But who are they to ruin my day when you're all around? Things are going my way, and you know, you make me smile. My spirit's high, and I know why, cause she. 